Right, hi guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to a new video. Now, today's going to be the West Run Fulham preview, but before we start that, I'd like to tell you something that's quite important. Over, because obviously we all know about the impending lockdown and everything, and Christmas is fast approaching, and I felt that there's going to be a lot of people that may have lost family, or many people that be struggling because they can't see family this year. Christmas might be tough for a lot of people, so... For that, I've decided to start something exclusively to me. So, for those of you who didn't watch my Q&A, I am professionally a magician. And I decided that every day from December 1st to December 25th... Sorry about fast breathing, by the way, it's just... I don't know. <laughs> from December 1st to December 25th, I'm going to be posting a magic trick that I do from my repertoire every day. Now... Uh, the reason for this is mainly just to try and give somebody who needs it a bit of positivity, a bit of entertainment, morale boost, something that they can smile about each day because that's going to be important for a lot of people. So I'm hoping that it works well. Um, now I'm going to be posting this on Twitter, Instagram, no not Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and a YouTube channel that I'm setting up now. I'm not set up yet, there'll be more to come on that, but it'll be something along the lines of the Magic West Brom fan. And I'm going to be doing that, and then I'm going to be posting little things about West Brom, and then little things about Magic, but the first 25 are going to be all the Magic tricks I'm going to be posting once a day. Now, hope, now when this channel gets uploaded, anyone who watches this, please subscribe to it, and please let other people know, because this could be, hopefully this is something that's going to be really good for morale boosts. For those who need it, we all know someone that's going to be struggling this Christmas. And Christmas is meant to be a time where people can smile and be with their family. And unfortunately, a lot of people might not have that this year. So hopefully this will be able to help. So more to come on that, but I just wanted to let you know. And when it when it's up, um, I'll share my socials. It, my Facebook is Magic. My Instagram is FVWBA52. And my YouTube is is coming soon. But please share that. Please let people know and get the word out. Hopefully it spreads well and I hope you enjoy it. That's my thing. Now, on to the preview. Fulham. I don't think I need to tell anyone how vital this game is. Um, it's a six-pointer. And literally a six-pointer because we are now... We could go about five points clear if we beat Fulham. And even if we've not started too well, a five-point gap on the relegation zone after seven games, I think we'd all have taken. So this is a must-win. Now, that's not to say that this is an easy game. It isn't. Fulham are going to be needing this as much as we are, if not more. So they're going to be well up for it. It's going to be an attacking game. It's going to be tough. But... I think we'll, we can pull through it. We've seen results pick up recently. Played the second half against Brighton. Probably the best half of football we've played. Bar the Chelsea game. But we've played some really, really good stuff. And Colin Grant got a great goal. What I liked most about his goal was he didn't really dick about skills and stuff. <laughs> he just smashed it in the net. And we need someone like that. Callum Robinson also played well. Um... You've got a lot of players that were excellent, so we've got that to look forward to. Um, Philip Kravinovic, Conor Gallagher, all were excellent. Sam Johnson, particularly, I think he's probably been our player of the season so far. That was his 100th consecutive appearance now. I know people can say he's a goalie, but to keep that level of fitness up over that time is incredible, so congratulations to him. Now, Fulham got some dangerous players. You've got Mitrovic, Kearney. Uh, De Collar Reed, um, just to name a few. They've conceded a lot this season, but they've scored a few as well, so that's not going to be easy. But I have a feeling that we can overpower them. We've got a more, I think our squad is better suited to this game. I think Billich is going to go all out. So, key players, obviously, I've li listed them. What do I think the score is going to be? Um, I'm going to go 3 3 2 Albion. Tense game. I'm going to go with 
Grant to score two. I'm going to go Callum Robinson. No, no, I'm going to go Grant Robinson Kravinovic. I'm going to go Mitrovic and Kearney for Fulham. Now, massive game, massive game. We've all got to be there. Sit, do what you can do while watching it in the pub before we go into lockdown. Um, we, we've got to win this. Hopefully we do. And I've got full faith in the lads. We're looking better and the win will come if this win comes. We've got two tough games to follow, so vital. Come on you baggies, let's get those three points away to Craven Cottage. I'm gutted I can't be there, it's one of my favourite away days. But you can't do much about it. So, come on you baggies. Remember what I said about the magic, there'll be more to come on that. I'll probably do a video specifically about it in the coming few days when I've shored up the details. But if you've got any messages about it, DM me to either Instagram or Facebook, Twitter, any of my socials. Or put any questions about it in the comment section. I'll answer them best I can. Have a great day. See you all soon. Bye bye.